All right, today I am taking a look at Uncle Nearest Rye. And Uncle Nearest has been one of the rising star brands of the last couple years, Tennessee whiskey, and uh, it's done a fantastic job. They've just brought this rye out. And, and the reality is, uh, if you're a modern brand that has to source, uh, and you don't really know what your volume is going to be, if it takes off like a rocket ship, you're going to have to find some stuff where you can. So uh, if you look at the back here, you'll see this is a product of Canada, aged in New York and Tennessee, aged and bottled uh, by Nearest Green Distillery, Shelbyville, Tennessee. So quite a journey for these barrels. Uh, bottling um, a, a kind of an American style whiskey with Canadian product is nothing new. Whistle Pig has been doing it and others doing it for a long time. So um, I don't get stuck on that, but uh, it, it is in interesting that you know, and parts of this brand are very Tennessee centric. And obviously this little piece of it, the, the actual source of this particular juice uh, is, is not, but that doesn't mean it's not been blended and, you know, some processes done there that make it distinct um, as a different type of product. So anyway, that's sort of the, the gist on this, but let's go into it. So really interesting on the nose, you've got Kind of a maple and vanilla cake, uh, pretty reminiscent of a Canadian whiskey. <sighs> Maybe like a touch of grassiness and spice. Let's take a sip. Um, nice, soft oak, more sort of soft vanilla. It's sort of a hallmark of Canadian whiskey. There's kind of a walnut, there's sort of a nutty flavor that's a little bit different than some others uh, that I've tasted in the past. There's a nice warming spice throughout. And then there's sort of a, a little bit of honey on the finish. I think due to the sweet nature of this rye in particular, where the sweet notes are up front, the maple, the vanilla, and then the warming spices just throughout. Um, this is gonna appeal not just to like hardcore rye drinkers, but to bourbon drinkers as well. But remember, it's sweeter in general than an American style rye whiskey. So uh, just prepare for some extra sweetness with this. Um, but for 100 proof, not age stated, I think it's a fair price and uh, really excited and happy to see this brand continue to grow. Cheers.